so human beings are insane. I believe very much in the understanding of a unifying, loving being that people refer to as God and living in the present moment and finding the connectedness within ourselves. But I'm just sad because there's still so much chaos going on and I turned the radio on. I used to listen to NPR a lot many years ago and then there were reasons why they started to get on my nerves. But I've been listening again just to get, I suppose, as much information as I can. Even though I don't trust a fair amount of information that you get from even NPR. And it's a very left-leaning media source. And they're talking about all the killing. And sorry for losing control of my emotions here, but... Um, the way they were, it was Elsa Chang and some guy who was explaining the drone situation, supposedly Iran supplying drones, even though Iran denies it. And they were talking about that. And just the way they were talking, like about the U.S. now supplying very destructive, I don't know a lot about weapons, I don't care to destructive drones that are he's talking about used to protect the White House or something. So like he's like gleefully talking about weapons of killing. These people are supposed to be anti-war. Do we remember what liberals used to be? They were the ones who were against war. And now they're the ones that are touting and promoting war. What has happened? This is insanity. This is supposed to be a party or side, all of which are made up constructs, by the way, that is about inclusivity, love, you know, justice, peace. And over the last several years, I have seen a major decline in those values. It's war, it's discrimination, it's but this one's big. This one's hard for me. I don't know how these people can sit and talk about the the killing of people, regardless of who they are. So nonchalant. It's like that many, many years ago, the WikiLeaks video, the really big one of the soldiers shooting innocent people, the way they were talking was so, I remember it struck me as so disturbing how people could become so nonchalant about killing. And that's what I'm seeing going on. And what is happening? Regardless of who thinks who's the good guys or the bad guys, we're talking about massive murder. People aren't thinking. And we're heading into a really scary direction. It's almost like people want war. It's almost like they want to see us destroy this freaking gorgeous planet. <sighs> I hope people wake up in time. because For a long time I felt really optimistic about humanity. <sighs> But I'm not sure we're going to make it at this point. I don't know if, if, I don't know what's happening. I don't know how things are getting so out of hand. This is, people don't understand, a lot of people don't seem to understand. Throwing some drones at this situation is going to heat it up. It's going to piss Russia off even more. And after the U.S. meddled around and, the affairs of Ukraine that pissed Russia off. I now I'm thinking the U.S. is meddling around with Taiwan, trying to piss China off. It's like that's like they're trying to cause a world war. <laughs> 